to the price at the pump tonight. Take a look at your screen. You'll see a massive jump between our current average and the average from this time last year. Almost two full dollars. The Bureau of Labor Statistics shows consumers are facing inflation rates not seen in four decades. Worse, those prices don't look like they'll stop rising anytime soon. You might be thinking of using some other types of fuel to try and save, but experts don't recommend it. THP 11's Ian Russell explains. I don't know about you all, but I am sick and tired of these high gas prices. I know a lot of you out there are probably feeling the same way. And some of you are probably looking at that ethanol handle and thinking, man, maybe I could use this as well. Well, mechanics tell me you could use this, but it's really not the best idea. At Coleman and Son Automotive in Little Rock, owner Duran Coleman knows his way around a car. Uh, normally they come in for automotive repairs. Uh, that means you're leaking something, smelling something or having some type of drivability issue. And he sees all sorts of issues. One thing he sees occasionally can seem small, but it can cause some major headaches down the road. And not in a lot of vehicles. Normally about 10% of vehicles made are have flex fuel. He's talking ethanol fuel. There's not many places that even sell it around central Arkansas, but there's a noticeable difference in price. Gas is so expensive right now. They too high, they way too high. They need to get cut down. And you might be thinking of putting it in your car to save some money, but those prices might be cheap today, but in the future they can cost you thousands of dollars. Your car will tell you pretty blatantly what kind of fuel it can take. Usually it's on the gas cap or right next to it. It's important to look at those labels or either check that owner's manual. If you drive a car that can use that ethanol fuel, don't worry. Experts say you probably won't see any issues like what we've seen with regular gas. I don't think so. I, I don't think that's going to be an issue. I mean, we, we've got plenty of corn out there and supply is probably not going to be an issue in terms of getting ethanol. Back at Coleman and Son, Coleman says he gets that prices at the pump might have you thinking for ways to save. He says you don't have to risk your engine by using something it's not supposed to have, though. There's much simpler ways to save. But the main thing to save gas is tire pressure, air filters, and you want to make sure you don't accelerate real fast. Driving fast does create more gas usage. In Little Rock, Ian Russell, THP 11 News. Thank you, Ian. Coleman says you can also tell just by the color of your gas cap, if it's yellow, then it should be rated for ethanol fuel.